21st of October 2022, 864 days after my final Cambridge exam. It's finally graduation time! Hello everyone, it's my graduation ceremony day. I've got the fluffy hood, we haven't attached it yet. My auntie is coming along with me to collect tickets and then we've got a rehearsal in college first. My auntie is pinning the hood onto the gown. It's our normal undergraduate gowns that I wore for formals and then you have a fluffy hood that attaches. It's a very complicated process. We were given a step-by-step -step instruction booklet but I'm not sure anyone understands it. You need a Cambridge degree to do it, <laughs> says AK. We'll line you up uh, in a nice straight line uh, in rows of up to four. The line-up order um, happens in a particular way. So first we have those who are coming back to celebrate degrees that they actually received uh, in absentia during COVID. Woo! Hooray! Congratulations! Finally! The day is here! So the rehearsal is done, everyone. We are now leaving the rehearsal. We've got to line up in the first floor. I need to give my family my phone in a minute because we're not allowed to take any bags or phones with us. Uh, but I'll get as much footage as I can. Look, we have some familiar faces who are also graduating today. Tim just awarded Isha his degree. How yeah, do you feel, Isha? I feel like absolutely honestly. <laughs> I awarded my degree by the Master of College, Tim. Yeah. Oh. He's been promoted. Tim the Master. <laughs> Court and we're going to be lined up in an order. Apparently the superior degrees go at the front and the lesser degrees, like my own, <laughs> go at the back. But I've got the fluffy hood, so really who's laughing? And yeah, we're going to line up in, in rows of four and then we're going to process and walk to Senate House. Fantastic. Yes. All your friends with you, Paige? My friends are all sorting their heads out. And let's have a look at the back of your hood. Very nice. Do you know who you're lining up with, Paige? No. Yeah, she can start to line up now. She's like, everyone else, all parents and guests can make okay. their way. Hank Etienne Presento at the Hag Eden Webis Preister. Paige Yallop. Tibi Etiam, Gratulor, Yundem Gradum. Jesus College. Guys, I have just graduated. I went up by myself. It was very scary, but I had a whole hand to hold of the proelector, and I had to do a little, a little bow. And they read some Latin words. I just walked outside, and we've come round the other side of Senate House. My friends and I have had some photos outside the Senate House. Now we're waiting for my parents because my parents are still stuck in there. I was like quite early on in the ceremony because uh, our college went first. Like lots of colleges were having graduation ceremonies today but Jesus was the first one called up and people who were celebrating their degrees rather than conferring their degrees which was me we went up first so I was in like maybe like the fourth group to go up I've just spotted my sister at the gate so I'm gonna go with her in my sister has made it my sister actually missed the live stream so my auntie and my sister couldn't get into Senate House my parents are still in Senate House watching the rest of the uh, ceremony but 
My auntie and my sister unfortunately couldn't get in because it was just two tickets allowed per graduand. AK watched me on live stream. It was good. It was good. And we've got the video for Lydia to watch back later. Lydia didn't make it back to college in time to I watch it. I made it back it. to college, but I couldn't find it. Oh it dear, Lydia got lost in college. And they were like, oh, we don't know where it is. Senate House was cool inside, though. I don't, I don't know, know how much is. you saw on the live stream, but it's cool. I've never, you never really go in Senate so House. They check your dress and everything. Like, they're quite particular about, like, where your hoods are hanging. So they were folding everyone's hoods over as we were waiting. It's a bit and, of a um, Santa Claus type thing. It is quite Santa Claus-esque. It's, it's really quite furry. I went up by myself because there were five people who were like collecting the same degree as me and you go up in groups of four normally and because my surname was last in the list I was I was put in a row by myself but actually I was quite honoured I felt like it was all the attention on me do they get so Ed and Isha were getting masters they've done an MSI whereas I was collecting a BA Cambridge is a bit weird and all like three year undergraduate degrees are, are a BA, a Bachelor of Arts, rather than a uh, Bachelor of Science. So yeah, this is the BA hood, and you'll see around us lots of people in different coloured hoods, which all represent different degrees. is down King's Parade so behind me you can see King's Parade there we are in the centre of Cambridge you can't get more Cambridge than this I've just ordered a frame for my degree certificate, which is going to go up in my house, of course, proudly displayed. It's so windy, which is the unfortunate thing, so I think 99.9% .9 of the photos will have my hair like... Are you sure we shouldn't go and get a professional picture? I don't want a professional photo. I do want to get... There's a photo of me taken like kneeling in Senate House, and I definitely want to get that. And here we have um, Tim's family. Here's Tim. <laughs> Two years. Yeah. <laughs> How's it feel to have celebrated? Yeah, it's nice. It's a nice thing to celebrate. My hat's way too big, but I love it. It's too small. Yeah, Paige's is too small. <laughs> we are just walking back to Jesus for a drinks reception. It starts at two, and we want to be there for two on the door because we don't want to miss out on the drinks. That is one of the perks of graduating. They put on a nice event for you at college. I picked up my degree certificate. I haven't looked at it yet, so I'll, I'll look at that when I get into college. Had a nice morning. The rain's fell off. Very, very happy. <laughs> I just felt so much pressure when I was waiting to I go know, out. And you were on your own. I know, it was because I was by myself. I was like intently watching the people ahead of me so that I could copy what they yeah, did. did yeah. You the took order his whole hand, didn't you? You were shaking his hand. I did hand. take his whole hand. No, I didn't just get a finger. finger. Yeah. Finger. Normally yeah. it's a very weird tradition where yeah. everyone <laughs> takes one finger, but I got the full hand. Yeah. But no, I was standing there and you know when you get nervous and you start forgetting what you need to do? Yeah. So I was just standing there thinking, right, remember, hold full hand, step kneel. Forward. Oh yeah, I nearly forgot. He, he had to whisper to me, step forward. <laughs> and I was like, yep, yep, remember that. Pray hands, stand up, bow and leave. I feel like I executed it quite well you in did, the end. You did very good. I was I was nervous. I oh saw Tim ahead of me and Tim did the most amazing bow. It was very clean. Anyway, um, we'll see you back in college. <laughs> so we're now at the drink reception. <laughs> We've got our drinks. This is the web library. Do you want to pan around a bit, Lydia, to show the web library? What do you think of the champagne? just sat down for what they're calling the congregation lunch. The menu is 
salad or baby leaf lettuce, simple beetroot, shaved buckswell cheese and globe artichoke, followed by breast of corn fed chicken, followed by bitter chocolate and stem ginger tart. Do you know what? That sounds quite nice. I might quite like that. Oh, Jesus menu there, congregation lunch. Um, I've brought down, I've got a top up, top up of Prosecco at the drinks reception because I prefer that to wine and I've brought it down with me. Omnium in teas piciunt et in teas sperunt deus, tudus ille sescam tempora potunum, aperus domanos et imples omne animal benedictione tuum, benedict nobis domine, et omnibus tuis donis quaex larga levararitate tuus in jurisunus, viesum Christum dominum nostrum. Deus est caritas, qui manus in caritate manus in deo et deus in illo, sit deus in nobis et nos maniamus in illo. Amen. Hello vlog, we're taking photos outside Temple Street, which is where it all started five years ago. Quite crazy how time flies. There is a photo of me many years ago, right here, tossing our hands. And um, reminiscing on the good times, you know. <laughs> the hats work as frisbees as well. Which is I've nice. seen. Yeah. <laughs> it's a full game you can play with these hats. They're very versatile. Yes, very small tea, isn't it? It's a small tea. Hey, try and duck in with the tea. Duck in, yeah. Oh, I see a tea. Hey, girl. Duck in the tea. Should I, should I do the vlog? The vlog? Yeah, the, yeah. the vlog. We're in front of Here we go. We are back at 21 Malcolm Street, everyone. <laughs> You've seen this many, many times. Um, but can you remember what room I was in? Yeah, quick quiz. What room did Paige have at 21 Malcolm Street? It's a good question. It's a good question. Pan upwards, pan upwards. Oh, oh, pan upwards, pan upwards, okay? <laughs> up, up the top. Oh, we've seen one of the, the Cornwall pups that we had here that's been stolen by the people now living here. Unbelievable shopping. Current residents of 21 Adam Street get in contact with us because we have a cup to reclaim. <laughs> We've just got home. We're all just chilling, collapsed on the sofa. I changed out of my heels. Thank you, Hannah, for lending me heeled shoes because I could not find any and I was panicking last week. But luckily, Hannah has the same shoe size as me and came to my rescue. What a legend. Also, while we're at thank yous, thank you, Fatima, for looking after little Buster. Buster the Border Terrier is in Cambridge, of course, this weekend. It couldn't be left behind. But ugh, Senate House and College discriminates against dogs. Dogs are not allowed, I guess. I mean, they don't allow humans to go on the grass, let alone dogs. So he was left in the safe hands of Fatima, who looked after him, who was in my year at Jesus. So thank you very much. You're a lifesaver. Like, literally, someone would have had to miss out on the celebrations from the family. And it, you know, it would have been tough telling Lydia that she couldn't come to my graduation <laughs> celebrations. <laughs> So it's First, all good. thank you for being the photographer. Oh yeah, thanks to the family. I told them to help out with the vlogging. So I haven't looked at the footage they've got yet, but you guys will have seen it. So comment below what you think of their vlogging skills. Anyway, I'm, I think I might sign off my graduation vlog here because I don't think anything else graduation is going to happen, is it? I'm going to put my hat on. Oh, well, we've got presents for to you. To end the vlog. We have got presents Oh, actually, should you say we had not You've got me gifts. I was joking when I talked about graduation well, gifts. Okay, well, well, we'll open the graduation gifts on vlog before we finish. I'm giving Paige her graduation present from me and Dad. Thank you. Do you notice the bag? Stars. Yeah. Oh, Astros. Oh, oh, excellent. Yeah. Yeah. Is it? Yeah. That's a nice card. You see that? Very nice. So. Graduation it's a graduation charm. charm, yeah. That's really cute. It, I don't know if this is focused, but it's a little a little graduation hat. It's really just cool. like a signifies, you know. I like it's very much, yeah. Like oh, that was my graduation, so yeah. yeah. Thank you.
Oh, that's cute. It's a graduation tatty teddy. Isn't that cute? Okay, ending the vlog here. Thank you very much for watching, guys. It's been nice living out what I thought my graduation should be two years ago. Give the video a like, subscribe to my channel. Follow my Instagram, follow my LinkedIn, subscribe to my newsletter, all of those things to keep up with what I'm doing now in graduate life. We're now two years into graduate life. It's getting serious now, guys. We are a working woman and we're not a recent graduate. We are, we are a working woman with two years experience. Imagine that. It's quite scary that there are people coming into the workplace who are younger than me that they're asking me to train up now. Who gave me that responsibility? I'm probably not going to take this hood off really until I go to bed now because, you know, it's not really acceptable to wear any other time. If anyone else has graduated recently, congratulations. And um, I will see you soon with another video. Bye. Bye bye. 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 I'm Buster. Say goodbye. Look at him, he's so zonked.